Yazidism is a fascinating and ancient religion. It is primarily practiced by the Kurdish people. Yazidis are found mainly in northern Iraq, Syria and Turkey. Central to their belief system is Tawasi Melek, the peacock angel. Tawasi Melek is not just an angel, he is the most important figure in Yazidi faith. He represents the emanation of God's power and light. Yazidis believe that Tawasi Melek is the intermediary between God and humanity. He is often depicted as a peacock, symbolizing beauty, pride and immortality. The peacock's vibrant plumage represents the diversity and multiplicity of the universe. For Yazidis, understanding Tawusi Melek is key to understanding their faith. The Yazidi faith centers on the belief in one God, who they believe created the universe. God then entrusted its care to seven angels, with Tawusi Melek as the leader. This belief distinguishes Yazidis from other monotheistic religions. It highlights the unique position of the peacock angel in their faith. The Yazidi creation story is a tale of divine emanation. It begins with God who is eternal and beyond human comprehension. From God's essence, a primordial light emerged. This light solidified into a pearl. God then created the seven divine beings, also known as angels or holy heptad, from this pearl. These seven angels are not simply messengers of God, they are emanations of God's own being. Each angel embodies specific aspects of God's attributes and plays a distinct role in the universe's order. They are considered co-eternal with God, existing alongside him since the beginning. Among these seven, Tawuzi Melek holds a special position. He is considered the first among equals, the most perfect and closest to God. God bestowed upon Tawusi Melek the responsibility of creating the physical universe and all living beings within it. This act of creation further elevates his status within Yazidi beliefs. The story of Tawusi Melek's creation is central to Yazidi cosmology. It is believed that God created him on the first Sunday, making him the eldest of all creation. God then ordered the other six angels to bow before Tawusi Melek as a sign of respect for his seniority and power. However, one angel, often identified as Azazel or Iblis in other Abrahamic traditions, refused. This angel's refusal stemmed from pride and a belief that he was superior because he was created from fire, while Tawusi Melek was created from light. This act of defiance had significant consequences. God banished the defiant angel for his disobedience. Tawusi Melek, witnessing this, wept for the fallen angel. God, moved by Tawusi Melek's compassion, declared him the peacock angel and tasked him with ruling over the world. This event solidified Tawusi Melek's position as the intercessor between God and humanity. The peacock, with its iridescent plumage and majestic presence, is a potent symbol in many cultures. In Yazidism, the peacock transcends mere symbolism. It is the embodiment of Tawusi Melek's divine essence. The peacock's thousand eyes represent omniscience. Its vibrant colors symbolize the diversity of creation, and its majestic gait reflects divine grace. The choice of the peacock as a symbol for Tawuzi Melek is not arbitrary. It reflects the Yazidi belief in the interconnectedness of the spiritual and physical world. The peacock's beauty reminds Yazidis of the divine spark present in all of creation. Its ability to transform from a drab bird to a magnificent creature mirrors the potential for spiritual transformation within each individual. Furthermore, the peacock's molting and regrowth of its feathers symbolize death and rebirth a central theme in Yazidi beliefs. The shedding of old feathers represents the shedding of the physical body, while the regrowth of new, even more vibrant feathers signifies spiritual renewal and continuation in the afterlife. This cyclical process resonates with the Yazidi belief in reincarnation. Yazidism shares some superficial similarities with Abrahamic religions like Judaism, Christianity and Islam. Like these faiths, Yazidism is monotheistic, believing in one God who is the creator and sustainer of all. However, the similarities end there. The role of Tawusi Melek and his relationship with God distinguish Yazidism significantly from these faiths. One key difference lies in the interpretation of the fallen angel narrative. 
While Abrahamic traditions often identify the fallen angel as Satan or the devil, a figure of evil, Yazidism views him as a repentant being who ultimately earned God's forgiveness. This difference highlights the Yazidi emphasis on God's mercy and forgiveness. Moreover, the concept of Tawusi Melek as the intermediary between God and humanity does not have a direct equivalent in Abrahamic religions. While angels exist in these traditions, none hold the same level of importance or authority as Tawusi Melek in Yazidism. This distinction underscores the unique position of the peacock angel within the Yazidi faith. While Yazidism is distinct from Abrahamic faiths, it shares intriguing parallels with older religions like Zoroastrianism and Hinduism. Like Zoroastrianism, Yazidism emphasizes the duality of good and evil, represented by the story of Tawusi Melek and the fallen angel. However, unlike the Zoroastrian concept of two opposing forces, Yazidism views both as ultimately subservient to God. The concept of reincarnation, central to Yazidi beliefs, also finds resonance in Hinduism. Yazidis believe in the transmigration of the soul through multiple lifetimes, striving for spiritual purity and ultimately returning to God. This cyclical understanding of life and death echoes the Hindu concept of samsara, the cycle of birth, death and rebirth. Furthermore, the peacock, a symbol of Tawusi Melek, also holds significance in Hinduism. It is associated with Saraswati, the goddess of knowledge, music and arts, and with Krishna, a major deity in Hinduism. This shared symbolism points to potential cultural and religious exchanges between these traditions in the past. The veneration of Tawuzi Melek permeates various aspects of Yazidi culture and religious practices. One of the most important rituals is the annual pilgrimage to Lalish, the holiest site in Yazidism located in northern Iraq. During this pilgrimage, Yazidis perform rituals like bathing in sacred springs, lighting oil lamps and tying knots on sacred cloths, all seeking blessings and forgiveness from Tawusi Melek. Another significant practice is the celebration of the Feast of the Assembly, a multi-day festival that honors Tawusi Melek and the seven divine beings. During this festival, Yazidis gather for communal meals, prayers and traditional dances, reaffirming their faith and community bonds. The peacock plays a central role in this festival with its feathers used in rituals and decorations. Moreover, the importance of Tawusi Melek extends to everyday life. Yazidis often invoke his name for protection and blessings. They avoid specific actions considered disrespectful to the peacock angel, such as spitting on the ground, wearing the color blue associated with the fallen angel, and consuming certain foods. These practices reflect the pervasive influence of Tawuzi Melek on Yazidi life. <laughs> Thank you.